Hi, this is Mohammed Shakil here and uh, today I'm going to show you how to start a new file in the drafting workbench using the start menu. So uh, basically this kind of technique uh, by invoking the start mechanical design and drafting technique is being utilized when you already have a part or an assembly file already open in the separate window and you, can, uh, you want to generate the drawing views for the part or the assembly. So to start off, I'm going to open up an existing assembly or a part. So in this case, I'll just open up the assembly for a tail stock. And uh, let's see what happens and uh, how to work with the drafting technique. So I'm going to the drafting here. And we have this new creation, new drawing creation dialog box. So we have few options over here, some preset options. So let's see what each option explains. So this is called as the empty sheet. The empty sheet option is used to start an, an uh, empty sheet without any view. After starting a new file using this option, you need to manually generate the views. So the next one is the all view, which is being selected by default. So all views option is used to generate the front, the right, the left, top, bottom, rear and the isometric views which is being shown as a thumbnail, some thumbnails over here and uh, it automatically creates in the drafting workbench. So the next one over here as you can see it's the front, bottom and the right. This option is used to generate the front, bottom, bottom and the right views automatically after starting a new file in the drafting workbench. And uh, the last one is the front, top and the left. So as I said, it's uh, useful creating the front, top and the left automatically. So uh, another option over here is to modify. So to modify the dimensioning standard format of the sheet and the default view scale, choose the modify button from the new drawing creation dialog box so as i have explained in my previous video uh, about this setting the standards and the sheet styles everything you can set over here and you can even select the portrait on the landscape option over here once you are set with all the standards you can click on ok and then you can click on this option right here so here i'm selecting all views and I'll click on OK and you have your uh, all your views being created in the drafting workbench. So this is about uh, the creation, automatic creation of uh, different views and invoking the drafting workbench using the start option in KTAB5. So I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you're following the tutorial as well and uh, keep commenting keep liking my videos uh, give me suggestions to improve and uh, thank you so much for watching all